ni hajeni watu wangu so mimi nimekuja hapa kuwachanua kuna video nilifanya nikiwaambia kuna ah, kazi zingine ufai kufanya kwa Mwarabu na nimerudi tena nimerudi na video original kwa sababu kuna watu walikuja wakaniambia nataka muangalie hii video yenye kwa kwa screen huyo ni Kadama kwa Saudi Arabia watu wengine walikuja wakaniambia sijui napotosha wa Kenya sijui nini hapana si kupotosha wa Kenya mimi naambianga mtu umeenda kwa nyumba ya Mwarabu singi imeblock hata unataka kujifanya wewe unajua hata kama umesomea electricians hata kama umesomea plumber as long as umeenda kwa nyumba ya Mwarabu as a domestic worker hmm? usijiingize kwa hizi kazi zingine ati jo imeblock wewe ndio huyo na kirere yako umeenda kuwa ni block kazi zingine kama hizi hizi kazi zenye unaona hapa kwa screen hizi ni kazi za garden na my friend hizi ni kazi za garden imagine umeenda kukatakata sijui mamiti huko nje umeenda kukatakata mamiti huko nje sing kwa singi vyombo zinakungojea maybe uko na mtoto mtoto anakulilia unakuja unampea chakula maybe hama mwina kugojea maybe manguo zinakugojea ufue maybe basi inakugojea maybe hujaosha hata nyumba alafu anakutuma uende ukakatekate kuni huko nje hata nyoka inaweza toka from nowhere ikuje ikuume kukatakata kuni ama kukatakata mavitu ma huko nje hiyo sio kazi yako hiyo ni kazi ya gate na my friend ikatae kataa hiyo kazi kama unaambiwa atienda ukaokote kuni mahali fulani enda ukakatekate miti fulani hapana hata unaweza kidnapiwa huko na utajulikana mahali huko ama uangukiwe na miti ukinini ukizikatakata alafu ukufie huko ai vitu zingine hata huko Afrika sisi hatufanyi manzi ati sasa babu zimearibika wewe ndio huyo unapanda juu ya meza na hata umevaa kidera kama mimi eh atu nataka kuonyesha vile wewe unajua vitu Usi, niliwaambia msikue na vierere kama wa filipino ati wewe ndio huyo unaenda kutengeneza bulb unaenda unashika bulb na kupiga shock unaanguka unakufa eh na hivyo ndio mwarabu atasema umepata accident Ulie, ulikuwa umetumwa na nani u, ukapande utengeneze mabulb wewe ni ele, electricians Ulienda kwa hiyo nyumba kama domestic worker stick to your lines. And this is message for all Kenyans, not even Kenyans, all Africans in Gulf countries. You have to refuse some some of the work you are being given in these Arab houses. Eh hey, mimi niko hapa kuachanua nilifanya hiyo video watu wakakuja kwa inbox wengine wakiniambia napotosha watu. Sio kupotosha watu mimi nitazidi kuwaambia kila kitu atutatumika kama slaves hapana atutatumika ati wewe ndio huyo haya maybe mko na greenhouse wewe ndio unaenda kunini kununuzia maji greenhouse mko na mashamba wewe ndio umeenda kulima shamba hapana my friend mimi sitalima hata sijui kulima ni nini nitajifanya sitalima hadi mko na sukuma mko na matamara Muko na sijui nini unaambiwa uende ukalime. Mimi nikijipata hivi nijipate. Na nikawaambia mkiona red flag wa Kenya wetu not even uh, Kenyans lakini wa Afrika wanakufia hapa uh, Saudi Arabia wengi sana. Wengi sana. Na mimi nitashindia nita kuambia hizi red flags ukiziona kwa nyumba ya Mwarabu you either go back to Kenya ama go back to the office ubadilishiwe nyumba na nikawaambia you make advantage of probation period the 90 days of your first period of your contract kama kwa hiyo nyumba ya Mwarabu hii ni red flag number one. kama kwa hiyo nyumba ya Mwarabu maybe unateseka maybe wanakunyima chakula there is no way utafanya kwa nyumba ya, ya Mwarabu ati unasema wananipea tu salary as long as wananipea salary chakula sio shida my friend usikuwe mjinga kama Ethiopia kwa kukula mabaki utakula mabaki aje wakati wewe ndio house manager house manager yani you are taking care of their houses wewe ndio unatandika bed wewe ndio unafanya kazi zote za hiyo nyumba unapiga nguo basi in fact you are supposed to be even taking a milk for your safety if at all you guys you are uh, you are doing ironing yeah 
and for the sake of these things these de detergents you are you are using you are supposed even to take uh, milk also so kama unanyimwa chakula kwa hiyo nyumba yenye huko tafadhali you better rudi ba, rudi to the office ama rudi to the Kenya red flag ya pili kama wanakunyima salary ati umekaa mia, miezi mbili ujalipwa miezi tatu wakikwambia tu kesho kesho kwani wewe ni mchinga aje ni pesa imekutoa Kenya pesa ndio imekutoa Kenya my friend don't be stupid umekuja hapa kutafutia wa... na ndio maana nikawaambia hata kama una watoto sema uko na watoto wawili at least ukiitisha salary ukiwaambia watoto wangu wamefukuziwa school fees watoto wangu watalala njaa watoto wangu wanataka kwenda hospitali at least they will be yani tutumiange hiyo kitu kama catalyst catalyst ni anything that will speed reaction <laughs> nimewarudisha tena kwa chemistry anyway red flag number three kama unarepiwa na sijui hii kitu ya kurepiwa inafikianga wapi nyinyi watu tu ndio mnaonyesha waarabu meno wanaanza wanaanza kupitana na nyinyi mwarabu mwarabu wa mwanaume anataka apitane na wewe umuguzishe tumatako umuguzishe kifua eh? ati akikuchekesha unacheka usi niliwaambia msikue na mentality ya ati mwanaume wa mwarabu anakutaka usikue toa hiyo mentality kabisa juu utafanya kazi Jitume, jiambie hapa kwa kichwa mimi nimekuja kufanya kazi sija kuja kukatiwa na mwanamume I know most of our Kenyan ladies ni warembo sana na wamebeba yani ni mali safi kuliko wanawake wa hiyo nyumba lakini sasa usijiambie hivyo wewe sema ni kazi imekupeleka hapo stick to your lines guys stick to your lines and you will in you will be in a better position and guys before we go far kindly smash that uh, like button smash that um subscribe subscribe button subscription is free guys ni peni to subscribe we are road to 100 at least we to put a your silver button ndio sasa ni waitia kangombe tukate eh anze jo so we were talking about the red flags tukasema eh, red flag nyingine ni kama unachapwa kama unachapwa na mwarabu my friend wacha ni kuambie ujui next atakufanyia nini next time kama mwarabu amekuchapa kofi ama maybe amekuchapa na kitu next time hata anaweza kukudunga na kisu ama akuchape kichwa na unajua kichwa ikikuwa damaged ama ama mendula obligata ikifikiwa hivi my friend you either die ama ukue upatwe na koma so kama mwarabu anakuchapa you never know next atakufanyia nini red flag ya mwisho tafadhali mwarabu kama amesema kwa nyumba yake hautatumia simu please go back to the office ama ukemboi ama urudi Kenya zako tafadhali ujui kwa nini mwarabu hataki ukitumia simu maybe anataka kukuua maybe anataka kukutesa maybe anataka kukutesa na salary hmm? all those stuffs And guys, wacheni tumalizie hapo. See you in the next video. I love you so much and thank you so much for your support. We are road to 100. Only 30,000 and then we get a silver button. The courtesy of the Ivano TV fans. You guys have noticed you love me so much. And that is why I'm telling you lazima nitawaitia kangombe tukate ngombe at least tusherekee pamoja kwa sababu hii upendo sio ya kawaida na hakuna haja ya mnigoje nikufe ndio sasa muanze kushia video zangu share saa hii kwa sababu niko uhai bye bye for now see you in the next video <laughs> Imano unakuwa kana ujinga akia nani? Kai, atasema nini? Ai ai ai. Anyway, guys. Kama ndio Imano anatu record. Oh.